a fan of softball, then you are going to love the Fast Pitch TV show. We're bringing you more interviews, more videos, and more product reviews than anyone else on the planet. Sit back and get ready. Here's the Fast Pitch TV show. Hello and welcome to the Fast Pitch TV show. Now if you found our show on Facebook, MySpace, or another video sharing site, please check out our website at fastpitch.tv. It's the place to find all of our past episodes and the place to keep up with our future episodes too. I'd also like to thank, thank our sponsor, softballjunk.com. Please take a second, check out their website at, well, of course, softballjunk.com. Now at the end of today's show, I'm going to give you a special code that they've given us. Now this code will give you $20 off softball bats at their website. So stay tuned till the end of the show so you can get that code, okay? Now this week, I revisit the camp that the NFCA held in Denton, Denton, Texas, at the Texas Women's University. Now if you're a regular viewer of the show, you know I'm a big, big believer in the National Fast Pitch Coaches Association, the NFCA. I just think it's a great organization, tons of great things for coaches. While at their coaches camp in Denton, I filmed John, and I know I'm going to pronounce this wrong, Tasasta of the University of St. Thomas, as he explains the bare hand. One thing about the bare hand, uh, Kate, how do you like your bare hand? You like it a lot? I like it a lot. Okay, so it's off. We're friends. <laughs> you like it on the side, on top, <laughs> or where do you put it? Oh. I like it. Like not quite on the top, on the on the side, and then ready to grab the ball. Somewhere out. in between both yep. of those. Are you yep. a politician? <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, if you were to take uh, what I what I like to do, I used to do that myself. Just uh, no one really taught it. You know, hand two hands all the time they'd teach. And then uh, through college, uh, this really helped me. I think, especially playing a rough field. Just take your bare hand, put it in your face. Now, I'm not going to do that, but this is the idea. Now you're going to bring that hand forward towards the ball. And now you have what we would call big alligator jaws. But notice how my fingers are pointing to the sky. And what I like about that, when I get down in perfect feeling position, is that I see that ball coming in. And now as it comes in, if it would take a bad hop and it's usually going to be out there somewhere, now all of a sudden I am keeping my fingers pointing to the sky, and then I come up on top of it. It saved me a lot of bad hops off the chest and the face. Now you want good feet and you want a glove to go get it, but sometimes it takes a wicked hop out front and that will always protect your body. So if you go down, now my hands can protect my body pretty easily and make those plays. So that I like rather than here, I'll all of a sudden get a, a real quick hop on me. Okay, so bare hand on top. Go ahead, go down again. Okay, now go out and make the short hop, the glove on the ground. I really emphasize glove, I call glove touch emphasize, glove on the ground. I thought some of the balls that you guys missed were just because the glove wasn't down working its way up. Okay, from this one, spread your feet out a little wider. A little wider, very good. A little wider even. Good. And what I like to do is get yourself uh, stand up for a sec. Now, I know I'm in Texas, but downhill skiing. You ever seen that? Okay, have you ever done it? Yeah, okay. Put your elbows on your knees for a second. Back flat, butt down, okay? Now, nice and low. Now you're downhill skiing. Tuck the elbows. Ready, you're flying down there, very good. Now slide the elbows out. Okay, now you're in that position where your hands are out front. Very good. Bare hand protects the eyes, face. Okay, now let's say that ball, you got to go up and make the short hop shorter. Okay, that's good. Now at some point, you can't get any further, right? Take this hand away. And now look how all of a sudden you just added about three or four inches. Usually that's all it is. You're just cutting inches down. So allowing this hand, this is, I, I would say, uh, this is high school feeling, or this is uh, kids, I even blow. When I'm working with third graders, through probably uh, something around seventh grade, I'm always teaching absorbent because that's how they can be soft. When you teach this, and you can just remember my days when I was that age, I'd teach go forward, I would have been stiff. So I always teach this way with younger kids. As they get older, you know, seventh and up to the high school, then we want to start going towards it. Okay, then I would say the major league level, all of a sudden you start to see I'm going to go towards it, I'm going to pick my hop by taking that hand away. That's the difference between the great ones. It's no longer like, oh, it was a bad hop. No, I made it a good hop. And all of a sudden now, my shoulders are already in line with that throw. So it's a little thing that you're going to find the great ones do, but you don't hear it taught very often. Okay? So that was just a little tip there. I hope you enjoyed today's show. Now, if you've never been to the NFCA website, you really need to. 
go visit it at www.nfca.org. You'll be glad you did, believe me. It's a great organization. Think about becoming a member. Before I close the show, I want to make sure that everyone who watches this show on their iPod, iPhone, or even the new iPads knows about our app. You can find more information on it at fastpitchapps.com. Now, our Fast Pitch TV app does cost $1.99, but what a great way to help support this show, okay? Now, don't forget to check out our website. It's located at fastpitch.tv. You can become a fan of the show at facebook.com slash fastpitchtv. Follow us on Twitter if you use Twitter at twitter.com slash fastpitchtv. Now, at the beginning of the show, I um, stated that I was had a special offer for you. Uh, for just for Fast Pitch TV Show fans, basically, from SoftballJunk.com. Now, SoftballJunk.com is giving you $20 off any non-sale softball bat on their website. And if they're on sale, this doesn't include that. But you can take $20 right off the price of any bat on their website that's not on sale. So the next time you buy a bat from their website, at checkout, just enter the code FPTV1. That's right. FPTV1. You can visit their website at, like I said earlier, softballjunk.com. Now, I don't mind you sharing this information with your friends. Tell everybody about it. It's a, it's a great offer for you, but please, don't give them the code. Don't just give them the code. Make them come and watch the show. Tell them about the show. Tell them to get the code from here. Help support us, okay? That's what this is all about. Well, that's all for today, so goodbye, and thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.